Hi, I'm Dr. Tori McJunkin. I wanted to talk to you about the exciting research study that we have at Arizona Pain Specialists. It's a stem cell study. I'm not sure if you know what stem cells are, but those are undifferentiated cells. And what that means is your body ha is made up of cells. When those cells haven't fully formed into a specific function, for instance, your liver cells are all made up of the cells that are identical, and they're very different than your cardiac cells or your heart cells. Your bone cells are different from those cells, and every tissue in your body has a different kind of cell, and that means those cells have differentiated and gone down a certain path. Stem cells are also found in your body. Typically, they're found in your bone marrow. At least that's the highest concentration of them. They're found in other places too, but stem cells are really unique because they haven't gone down that pathway yet to figure out exactly what kind of cell that they're going to become. And so we believe that they have regenerative properties. And so there's a lot of research studies that are being done right now using stem cells for various things. There was recently a stem cell study that was in the news where they were injecting it into cardiac tissue for people who had heart failure. And they actually had some pretty good outcomes. We're doing a stem cell study from a, with a company out of Australia called Mesoblast. The stem cells are being injected directly inside the disc and it's for people with a condition called degenerative disc disease. Degenerative disc disease is a condition that affects millions and millions of people just here in America. Um, it happens to many, many people as you get older, the discs start to degenerate and they start to shrink in their size. For many people, they don't have pain from that condition, but there are people who have severe pain from degeneration of the disc. There's a specific way that we test, called the discogram, test to see if your particular disc has degenerative disc disease and then also to see if it's causing your pain. If you meet those criteria then you also might be a candidate for the stem cell study. The stem cell study is looking at the safety and efficacy of using stem cells inside the disc to help people with those kinds of conditions. There, there are, It's an active enrollment. They're enrolling 100 people nationwide. We're one of a handful of centers across the country that are doing this and the only center in Arizona. Primarily, we're looking for people who have low back pain uh, with less leg pain. And what they're qualifying is 70% is low back pain and 30% or less leg pain. There can't be any severe bulging, disease, bulging disc disease or extruded disc or herniated disc. And there can't be severe spinal stenosis or narrowing of the spinal canal. The degenerative condition also needs to be causing pain at one level. And that's something that will help to figure out and see if you're a candidate for that study. This is a spine model. This is the front part of the spine. This is the back part of the spine. This is an example of a herniated disc, also called a bulging disc. If the disc comes all the way out, it's called extruded. Those uh, people who have that condition will not be candidates for the study, unfortunately. What we're looking for is a disc that shrunk down in size and it's been degenerated. And you, we can see that on the MRI, and then we test to see if that's the source of your pain. We place a needle directly inside the disc, we pressurize the disc under x-ray guidance, and then we are conversant with you and we ask you, is this your pain? How bad is this pain? We do it at several levels, so we can test a normal level compared to the other level that we think might be causing your pain. If we do diagnose that a certain level is causing your pain, it's the exact same procedure. We introduce a needle inside the disc and then we inject the stem cell inside the disc to help repair and regenerate the disc. You can read more about this study on our website. If you think you might be a candidate for this study or if you're interested to see what other treatment options might be offered, please visit us at Arizona Pain Specialists. Thank you very much.